Hello everyone, welcome to IC Training Nepal and today I am going to give you some top tips for working smarter, right? Okay, so this is a different video from others. So it is the top tip for working smarter. So it doesn't matter what you are going to work with or it doesn't matter you are working on the assignments you are, are working on the college things you are working on your personal things or you are working on the official things so here is the top tips for working smarter okay and this video um slide things okay so this is like a slide so this is the slide so which i have taken from the interquist group so let's talk about it okay so first of all first things is in the top tips of working smarter the first thing is the prioritize tax okay so my dear friends my dear colleagues my dear viewers i want to say that the first thing is the prioritizing the tax yes you feel little lazy okay so you feel lazy about the prioritizing tax so you feel little you know sometimes it happens if people are just saying that we only prioritize the tax prioritize tax and it doesn't work out but that's not the thing prioritizing the tax is a good way for working the smart full things okay so working is smarter the one thing is prioritize your tax which tax is important to you at first okay you have to write it down anywhere you have to write on the note or you have to write anywhere you want and the prioritize your tax and first of all at the beginning of your day you have to prioritize your tax and then you will go through the tax okay so let's go to the second one so before that let's see this this one okay the prioritizing tax this is the first thing and this is the second thing and this is the third thing okay so here take into the account the amount of work which will be involved with the each one keep tax in order of importance and in order of the time frame in which they need to be completed this will allow you to prioritize your workload and optimize your time throughout the day okay so prioritize your tax is your first thing the second one is the avoid multitasking okay so please don't do that i want to say that avoid multitasking it is easy to become distracted by other tasks in the workplace okay so please avoid multitasking you want to do something you want to do other things so you want to take something you want to take, do other things so these things are the uh, thing which you are the uh, for example let's take it you have a uh, two projects and you want to do like multitasking in one skin you want to do one point in other skin you want to do uh, other points so please don't do that for that you can what you can do is just give one hour and that one hour will be fully focused on that particular project okay so avoid multitasking because it can be dist distracted and the other thing is you are going to work and you are working at a workplace and you want to check out your phone okay so don't do those things if you want to do those things you can do it but what you have to commit is just you have to commit the first tax the prioritize tax and you have to say uh, commit yourself that i am doing this uh, for one hour and after that only i will check the phone up otherwise i'll check that things so i will go through other things so the first thing is prioritize your tax second thing is avoid multitasking okay so try focus on one tax at a time as the best result will come from giving each tax your full attention use the list format to tick the each tax off one by one this will allow you to build momentum and get most out of your day okay so the third things get ready to for the third things is the schedule meetings calls and emails okay so the third thing is schedule okay so or the schedule meetings okay so if you are working with demanding workloads it is easy to be distracted by your calls meetings and emails throughout the day so for that what you can do is you can schedule your meetings or you can schedule your meetings calls and emails 
at the particular time so that you won't be distracted with other things okay so organize your schedule around the meeting you have booked and the calls you need to make keep track of when they are scheduled and during busy periods schedule times throughout the day to catch up on your emails this is where you can avoid the bombardment of the unread messages okay so you can do that thing and the other thing is the stay organized okay so look that thing is okay so stay organized okay what you want to do at a particular time okay so you want to take a uh, a coffee break um, in half an hour just stay organized okay you want to take a water break also uh, in the 15 15 minutes for so for that also try to stay organized being a busy working environment make it easy for your work pace to get messy okay so being organized should be span across everything okay so you have to be organized way okay so you have to be like that okay so you have to be in the organized way so what you have to be you have to be in the organized way stay organized okay so don't forget that So from keeping your decks organized to using your Outlook calendar for meetings and using the separate folders for emails, organization is the key to mapping a busy workload. Okay, so the thing is you have to be stay organized way. Okay, so try to stay in the organized way. So the other one is the set deadline. So what happens is in our like if we are the people and if we just save their lens what will happen is you you are working within a deadline and you are pushing up yourself okay so the thing is try to set the deadline okay so try to stay organized being in busy work environment make it easy for you to workspace to get messy being organized and should you spend the everything so set the deadlines other things okay so for example this is the part one this is the part two this is the part three this is the part four and you have to be work on your deadlines and you have to be commit on that deadline okay so your own deadline should be attainable and made with the overall project in mind this will allow you to finish the work on time and fit other tasks which need to be completed throughout the working day okay so these all are the some of the things which are really good so let's review it the first one is the prioritize tax and the second one is the avoid multitasking and the third one is the schedule meeting calls and emails and the fourth one is stay organized and the fifth one is the set deadline okay so these things you can work on these things and let me know how you you are working smarter so thank you so much and I'll see you in the next video. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. I see you in Nepal. Thank you so much.